so what's up what's up what's up okay so check this out oh i got a lot going on i did the best i could i did try to order online a couple of brands that was mentioned to me before in the past comments when it comes to diapers y'all when I tell y'all that the websites were not user-friendly, they were not user-friendly. So I'm like, I got to get this video done because I said I'm going back to some of that content that I was doing from before. So last time I talked about Depends when I did review a diaper. Horrible story time that I share with you all. But you know me, sometimes I got to make stuff a reality when it comes to my next story times like i did the last time when i went to well friday's restaurant but anyhow so this time i'm reviewing i even opened it and everything i was like what these things look like so it comes with a pack of 12 but i already done ripped it open and took one out so i'm gonna be trying this today and it says it holds Lord knows, I know how much <laughs> measurements I, I do know. Sometimes how much I do void. Um, but it says eight ounces to 236 mLs. And then it, you know, has a little icon with the cups there to give a visual for some people. But this is what they look like, I guess. I guess what I had before was more so like a brief. But I have been drinking a mixture of this juice here which has um, turmeric in it, okay? And turmeric, for some people, is good for inflammation. So I have not taken any OAB, overactive bladder medication. And with that been, being said, I've also been up in my intake on water because I wanna see what this is all about while I'm out. Because I'm going out today. I gotta cook today too, so I gotta, I gotta pick up some some groceries for what I wanna have to eat today. So I got my protectant this time. Last time I was out trying out a diaper and Lord, I did not have a protectant like in case it didn't go accordingly and the diaper wasn't able to hold. So this brand is Tranquility. Tranquility, that's the brand, Select. Value products by Tranquility Select. It says disposable briefs. Okay, so we're gonna see what this is all about. Like I said, I had already opened it. So I have to put this on. See what we're working with. And I'm gonna be out and about enjoying my day. And um, if I get that urge to have to use the bathroom, I'll be recording, of course. So this is like the before, you know, nothing is on. Well, don't take it like that when I say nothing is on. Don't take it like that. What I'm, what I'm saying is the diaper has not been put on is what I'm saying. Don't get it twisted. Some of y'all minds is something else. So let me correct that. Okay, so this is what the look is right now okay without having a tranquility select on okay so i'm about to get to it and see how this day goes so come with me yeah hear that yeah hear that so far the feeling of this is not so good. Mm, like, do I have it on properly even? Maybe I should have run the directions, but I thought, how hard can it be to figure it out? But so far, I do not feel secure in having this D-I-A-P-E-R on. I, I don't. I got one little blue sticky and I'm like, was all the blue sticky supposed to came off? I'm gonna have to read the instructions and at least try to give it a fair chance because 
I don't think I would really want to be out anywhere trying to use this thing. Okay, so like I shared previously, I had not taken any OAB medication. Overactive bladder, that is my diagnosis. Overactive bladder interstitial cystitis. So I had to use the bathroom before I left. Nerves were getting bad because I didn't feel secure. So I redid that previous diaper. Took off that one I had on and I don't know, it's like it just went every which way. I'm not sure how this was put on. Was I don't know, but I just had to redo it. So I'll be getting rid of this one. <laughs> okay guys, so I am making my way, on my way to the grocery store actually. glad to be a part of this grocery store and I'm just gonna say when something is different something appears to be abnormal to people you're gonna get looks that's just life so obviously I looked abnormal but I'm used to being <laughs> looked at anyhow during whatever certain situations that occur so it didn't bother me but it did kind of stand out like because I could see where people's eyes were going and what they were focused on. And by that time, I couldn't even hear the sounds of the diaper even making noises. But again, it's like, oh my gosh, what does people prefer? You to use the bathroom on your toe for, for you to like wear some type of... Uh, I mean, what about the people that have an... I don't get it. I don't get it. But I guess when something's just different, out of the norm, people are just going to look... I am just honestly feeling like, I'm not feeling deflated, but I'm like, dang, my heart kind of goes out to the ones who honestly do have to wear them and then have to worry about trying to camouflage. Is it noticeable? Because honestly, I'm just ready to go home and just use the bathroom at home. But I'm gonna do this experiment and see how this does go. But this is absolutely crazy what I just experienced. Okay guys, so I'm actually back from the store thank God. And I guess you can guess what I'm preparing. Yep, spaghetti. So guys, everything almost is mixed in. I'm going to stir this up. I did re-season the spaghetti. The noodles are over to the side. I don't want them to cook any further. And I need to use the bathroom. <sighs> okay, guys, so it has been a long day with a lot of looks in the process, but I just carried on business as usual. So spaghetti is done. The sides is done. What's going to be ate with the spaghetti is done. So I've been holding on to not use the bathroom and it is definitely, it's time to go to the bathroom, but I don't know what happened. It, it was, I'm uncomfortable. Just to be upfront with you, I am uncomfortable. This has been a very uncomfortable day in this diaper, this particular diaper. And I felt like there was no, there's no breathability going on. whatsoever. Th this is a totally different feel from the Depends. I don't know if it's because it's not, I mean, this is an actual diaper. I, you know, in my mind, I wasn't thinking diaper versus pull up. Like I'm thinking all, oh, it's, it's just all the same. No, it's truly not. It's not. This is just totally different. Like a feeling I've never experienced before. And the way things are being situated and like I said when I was inside of the grocery store I felt the weird looks and I, I and like I said I could see where their eyes were going that it made me look and I'm like dang what happened it's looking like that now so you know I've been cooking since I um been home been putting up groceries and all the good stuff, just what I normally would do. I was just trying to honestly take my mind off of having to use the bathroom. And to tell you the truth, I am shower 
ready because I know I'm gonna have to take a shower. So I don't know if I wanna give, like take the shower right now, then get a review or I don't know what I wanna do. This whole situation has just really, really thrown me off that I really didn't think out to this extent because I wasn't expecting to be this uncomfortable. So, I mean, you can hear it and you know, it just, the look of it, it's the feel of it. It's just, I'm just not feeling this whole situation. So I'm like, what did I do wrong? Goodness, like, like, what is that? I don't know, this just has not been a good feeling. So, like I said, I'm shower already. I'm about to heat the water up. Water is heated up. If you listen closely, you can still hear the diaper. Listen closely, please. Okay, so with that being said, we about to just, you just about to get my first like initial reaction of what I do think. Okay, so let's see. What do I think of this? Liquid is weight. Okay, I can only imagine how this would look if I was out and about at the grocery store needing to hurry and use the bathroom and how heavy this diaper would look. I can only imagine what type of looks I would be getting then. But again, if it's like a last resort and you have to do what you have to do, I respect that. So with that being said, those who truly do have to wear in cottons, pads, diapers, pull-ups, those who do have bladder issues, bladder control issues, like you're who I'm speaking to. This has nothing to do with anything other than that. Like I'm speaking from a for real medical condition doing a review. In this particular situation, this ain't it. This is not it. So with that being said, I'm about to get myself together, take my shower. Okay guys, really quick, let me retract some of this. I'm eating some of the spaghetti right now. It came out pretty good. But it was no leakage going on with that particular pamper. And it seems like it was liquid leakage with the depan. So let me rephrase that or recap what I did say about that prior. So it did hold. It was just extremely heavy, extremely heavy. So that's my take on that. It did hold. It was just really heavy, but again, it would have made me nervous. Like if I would have went and sat, some, sat down somewhere, what would have happened? Extremely, extremely heavy though. But how much does the average person void though too? That would have to be taken into consideration. I did mention what the void measure, measurements were, but yeah, that's my take on it wasn't bad it wasn't bad at all but the feel of it the look of it that was definitely uncomfortable <laughs> 